India is not only a key source market for Kenya tourism but also an ideal one as most of the travel from India happens in low season which not only fills up hotels but also offers good value for money for Indian visitors John Chircher acting CEO of Kenya Tourism Board tells India Outbound Chircher adds that besides the recent road shows in India he intends to launch a broader awareness campaign about Kenya in India ITB has really been great for Kenya uh, and especially Kenya Tourism Board. We are happy to have come with 45 companies and they are here present uh, looking forward to reconnect with the German tour operators, travel agents and also for airlines on Kenya Tourism Board. So far so good. We've had great meetings on day 1 and day 2 and we're looking forward to today for a range of a uh, list of meetings that are planned out. So it's really been great. The view of the market is that Kenya has a huge potential for growth. The recovery has has gone up well. We are at about 74% recovery generally as Kenya. Global average is about 63. So we are above that. But in looking into the future, a lot of inquiries about migration that is are coming up uh, about how uh, get people getting away into warmer destinations. So it's really been positive. But above all, nature, wildlife continue to be key. and Kenya has spaces for that so Kenya is a really a sought after destinations and there's a lot of inquiries business uh, b2b inquiries as well as from consumers that we are hearing what Kenya has to offer is really appealing to them I must say India market is one of the top source market for Kenya and a very important source market for that um, it's a leading this so market out of asia and we actually most of the travel happens during the low season so it which is a perfect fit for our destination there's not so much demand there's a lot of opportunity for creativity to fill up those numbers because the prices are the value is very high for what you pay you get extremely high value uh, wildlife continue to be key wildlife nature culture being on the open given that covid has taught us now to appreciate nature better so we the indian uh, market continue to be key we had a road show recently uh, in in key in three key sos market just at the backdrop of old, uh, india outbound travel mart that we had for 15 companies participating and there were beautiful engagements and feedback that we received so there is a hunger for kenya to be visible in the market This year we aim to actually achieve the 2019 arrival figures and grow above that. As much as India started a bit later, uh, we believe that those engagements and opportunities and the marketing activities Kenya Tourism Board is implementing will be able to not only sustain growth uh, to achieve the 2019 arrival figures but to surpass. Key for that is we have an e-learning program to support the trade and understand the market better. we want to work also directly with the consumer to help the trade activate the inquiries that they have so in terms of visibility what kenya has to offer as a brand the diversity the connection family travel individual travel uh, going out and being away from market just to rest as well as tapping into the mice opportunities that the indian market is really great at that is becoming a uh, part of the thing that we are looking at because there is connectivity we have Kenya Airways flights into India and the routing also by other hubs into Kenya is great so we are looking into a really a future that has a lot of promise yes there is there is a change people who have the time and the money are currently traveling but it's too early to really uh, be able to say there is a major shift Of course we have interest uh, nature growing uh, connection with the wild and the type of travel people who are conscious about the environment and sustainability is coming up not only being seen to have travel out but travel out for impact so when tra- tourists come to the destination india t- tourists come to the destination they want to go back with something more than that the the initial excitement and the initial interest in traveling 
but making an impact. Kenya Tourism Board is planning quite a number of activities. First is a presence in the market, connection through roadshows, B2B meetings, uh, exhibitions as well, participation, continued participation in events like SATE and OTM. Uh, but more importantly is visibility online, uh, working with the journalists to come and scope out the opportunities, not only the known areas of Kenya and known activities and experiences, but what else that the Indian consumer is mutating and looking forward to. So there will be a lot of online advertising as well as uh, engagement with influencers, content creators. VFRs continue to be key especially after COVID, that's part of the travel. Business travel has also become big. We want to reconnect with the corporates, uh, not only on incentive, but opportunity for meetings and conferences in Kenya. Of course, Bollywood continues to be key. Uh, we, we wish, we want to work with the Bollywood stars in terms of them visiting the country and showcasing it from a different perspective. MKT continues to be an important event for Kenya. This is where two operators, travel agents, and airlines come and meet in Kenya. And what we are looking at now for this year is really an opportunity to show the different aspects of Kenya that are less known. So experiences, location, destinations. Within Kenya, we have 47 counties. And within 47 counties, there are counties that are ahead in tourism. There are those who have great products and experiences but are not known. So we want to showcase those with MKT 2023 and show the world what is available.